everyone. I'm Dr. Karen Gray, Superintendent of Lincoln County School District. May is Asian Pacific American Heritage Month, and today I'd like to invite you to join me in paying tribute to the generations of Asian and Pacific Islanders who have enriched America's history and also are instrumental in its future success. Asian American and Pacific Islander Heritage Month or AAPI Heritage Month is an annual celebration that recognizes the historical and cultural contributions of individuals and groups of Asian and Pacific Islander descent to the United States. The AIPI umbrella term includes cultures from the entire Asian continent. This includes East, Southeast, and South Asia, and the Pacific Islands of Melanesia, Micronesia, and Polynesia. As of 2019, there were about 22.9 million people of Asian or Pacific Islander des descent in the United States. According to the U.S. Census Bureau, AAPI people are a diverse and growing population that make up about 7% of the total population of the U.S. The month of May was chosen for AAPI Heritage Month because it commemorates the immigration of the first Japanese people to the United States on May 7, 1843. And May 10, 1869, or Golden Spike Day, recognizes the completion of the first transcontinental railroad in the United States, which had significant contributions from the Chinese people as its workers. This year's AAPI Heritage Month theme is Advancing Leaders Through Opportunity. Opportunity is defined as a set of circumstances that make it possible to do something. Opportunity can be built, it can be accessed, it can be achieved, it can be given. It has been the foundation of our great nation and thus America is known to be the land of opportunity. Each year, thousands of immigrants from all over the world come to the United States to gain access to these wonderful and diverse opportunities for success. On behalf of our 184 students and 18 staff members who identify as Asian, and our 89 students and six staff members and board member who identify as Pacific Islanders. We honor you this month and every month. A special thanks to our school board member, Santila McKinley, who was originally from Tonga and moved to the United States in 1978 with limited English language skills. She naturally brings awareness of her culture and is passionate about literacy and helping children in our community. We are very proud of board member Santila McKinley and all she brings. Until next time, I'm Dr. Karen Gray. Bye for now.